is Vivek Vasco Das and oh my god you really broke into the video last time. I thought you I have just at least like 20 views maybe at least but when I saw today I was shocked and well I'm kind of impressed that I have over like 50 views now that is amazing. So today we'll be doing the amazing part of our Devil's Bridge. This is part 2 how to draw a naturalistic bridge or Devil's Bridge and I hope this would be helpful. If you find this helpful please subscribe. Yeah so oh I should show one time right because few of the newcomers may come to this video and go don't go to the last video so i'm saying you before that if you don't understand few of the tips and tricks today you might need to go to the first video because many of the tips and tricks are helpful and you it's means very very used tips and tricks which you can find everywhere not only in my channel so let's go and draw the devil's bridge and also here is the first part down here and we will draw the second part now i have chosen this bridge because well it has an optical illusion of a full circle when there is water below it because always there's water below but this devil's bridge makes a full circle um, like a hoop I guess and this is very naturalistic and stuff so let's get into it and also don't forget to like if you really like this video and subscribe if it was helpful to you but most importantly enjoy this video um you might need to wait this one minute because this is really hard to set yeah now done so this is our devil's bridge and which i do and this is the real bridge now you might be thinking oh no it's so not realistic so i've thought today to make it better as last time you did really helped me a lot so we will be using actual details in it and first we will go off with the water. This water is really hard part of this drawing because waters could be done by watercolor. Gotcha. And it's easier to blend colors in watercolor but this is actually crayon and it's dawn so well it's gonna be hard. So we have to use this because before I have done it by color pencil so I can't use the new uh, strategy of just changing it up and just go from uh, this color pencil to our watercolor and then again change. No, you can't do that in uh, any type of art only. Yeah, means many art those who use tips and tricks how to change art from this to this and many are only about uh, watercolors and oil pastel like that and yeah you can only do these supplies I guess you can say that yeah I don't know how much English text now so the fierce men of the Germany was maybe around the area. It was of 1860s. I don't think that that man would be there. And if you know the real World War II, you might know him. He is not only the angriest man in this world, but the rudest man in this world. Yes. It is Adolf Hitler. Sorry for that. I don't mean it. I don't mean it. But I have to 
wanted because it's needed. Haha. <laughs> okay, so we have almost covered the water. Yeah, these edges are kind of blackish. So this is kind of hard. So we'll just use our finger and mix the colors one by one. Yeah. They don't mix very well. I have to I have to use this smudger or else this kneaded eraser which I have which takes out color and you can use more colors on it which is very helpful. Now if you don't have a kneaded eraser you can use an eraser by just taking few parts of it and just using it like clay and doing this and I forgot. I told in my last video that I would do it yesterday but sorry that I could not do it yesterday because well yesterday was Rocky in India and I'm an Indian yeah so I had to means come on and go to Rocky and these also I had to do the festival first and then the art and it was almost about 8 o'clock and I don't do too much late art. Means I have made the art sometimes long enough but not lately arting means drawing late and doing sketches late in the evening and these also they will means I will not have a good brain that time. Because um, whenever it's late, my head is like a bomb. It blows up. Okay, so let's go on and draw this reflection in the water. Actually, what I could do was draw the trees. Yeah, but this will take a long time. Might as well draw the reflection also. It's very hard to do reflections in water. Because they are means so means so so means shakingly annoying. <laughs> shakingly annoying. What am I saying? My English is now really bad. So we have covered many parts of the water. It's not sewer, so we will not make it as dirty as it looks because it is autumn in this picture. Yes, it is autumn in this picture and this picture is really good if you draw it in the summer part. But they, my reference photo shows me that I should do autumn. So I have to. I'm also adding adding details to this which would help a lot mainly on the lighter brown you can see the details and this would make you know that here is copper and here is stone and these are so this would be a very useful trick so another thing I forgot to mention if you have something in the water and you did the landscape, but you can't understand what to do in the water. You just draw whatever in the water by touching it. Now, I have told in the last video, but for the newcomers, this here means light and this means dark because I am tightening it, but I am touching here delightfully. So, this would be very easily not seen by you because, yeah. Yeah, I know that because it's so light that you can't see even the sky because I have not drawn the sky. Wait, what? So first we will draw this and then we will draw this and that and everything I know. Okay, too much song. Now we have came again to the reflection now and you can see where my hand is going. I am not only drawing it on the line I did but I am also doing it outside the line because you don't know when water will change its form yes you don't know when water
water will change its form will it be a ice or will it be water vapor no one knows now i need my yellow which is very helpful both in glasses and both in uh, this orangish actually if you don't know the only color which is primary and which also helps a record as both cool and both warm colors is actually yellow because yellow makes green which is a cool color and again it makes orange which is a warm color so very little bit of fun fact over there it was really fun to find out that by myself which was not so fun but whatever coming up this is really going well as a beginner type of detail art beginner detail art yeah you can say that so this is looking really nice and i will use some little little yellow wrong sorry not wrong it's not wrong because it's correct yellow maybe it's wrong it's okay it's okay it's the correct yellow it's the lemon yellow color with some orange in it because the tree next to the greenish tree is kind of orangish pale orangish i guess and then it's beneath is fully orange so that's pretty hard as you could imagine this is the water is always a tricky part for me not in watercolor though because watercolor is too easy okay even if many people describe him as ferociously hard i think color pencils get an honorable mention in the hardest to draw water color colors water no the hardest to do water with these colors is mainly crayons water color i guess many people do refer it as hard but i don't feel hard when i do water color because if you don't know i have been doing watercolor since class 2 and i have started art with crayons since maybe about from last time so i told you in my last video so if you don't know that i like watercolor and i do this every time i will show my whole room one day yeah about when there will be more likes and views and these all so I do a setup tour one day. Ooh, there is there are long canopies also. Okay, okay. This is very fun too because not only we can adjust with my color ratio, but also choose my favorite color. Like in reality, you can get only a limited, but in virtual reality, where it's like autodesk or photoshop you can get many colors then also i prefer you to just do the reality because everything is done by the machine you fool you cannot do anything you don't understand reference please you should leave your computer drawing if you are artist or even if you are just spending time on it and you should spend time if you like art on real art yeah because that gives you enrichment and everything and also i forgot to say that most of the time when i draw in my autodesk sketchbook i just draw um, how will i do this how will i do that and nothing else if you are just planning how to do anything you should do this in a computer then more than a final sketch in your sketchbook 
because then you would have big troubles, which I had. Oh, I need to eat. the maple, maple bushes are back. They're back for revenge. Yeah, I say that back because I've drawn this and this tree, the maple tree. Does it have a fully grown color? Now, if you don't know, many of the maple trees are a color between red and then magenta and pink. And sometimes while doing the pink maple bushes or trees, they really confuse me and then I have to do this every time. So yeah, I have to do this very concentrationally, I guess. What to say? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so So this is really fun. No, I could no, I could yeah, I could use this trick. Now this trick is called a uh, Water hatching trick, I guess, because this is like hatching but in the water. Yes. Just make your art a little swirly and it will look like an effect that it is in the water and all that of its glory. Yes, art. Now that is really cool, okay? That is really cool. Yeah, like that. I have a needed eraser in the hand, that's why. So, now let's go to another maple bush. And in the middle there is a blackish green bush, I guess. Yeah, it's, I don't know much about plants. That's why I didn't use it as a terrarium, my thing. Because also I kind of don't know how to make terrariums. And I don't have aquarium. And I don't want an aquarium because those are expensive yes that's my choice <laughs> okay so let's go to the darkish blackish grayish thingy bush i don't know what, or how to say it i can't even pronounce it ew shame on you no not you but me i'm just telling to myself So, ooh, this looks kind of bad. <laughs> no, really. This is really looking like bleh. Like the Pokemon card of a Pokemon just doing bleh. Which was from Joto, I guess. Joto? Shuppet, yes. The Shuppet Pokemon card has a move called bleh. Not lick, which is a ghost type move, which could Shuppet could learn if he evolves, but it's bleh. And my art is now looking like that bleh. But, yeah. I don't know why I think of that, but that really puts me in rage of laugh. The rage of laugh. Not laugh. Not a normal laugh, but a rage of laugh. Ha ha ha! Okay, that was more evil than I laugh. But I even laugh harder. So. This is looking pretty nice, I guess. I don't know how to say how it's looking, but I guess it's rather nice. I have to add the trees though, which is a big thing to do or achieve. I'm using my pencil because the black is more blacker or darker than the, uh, this branches. So I will just use my old and trusty pencil you know what fur trees would fig or fig whatever you say but 
whatever you say, maybe pine cone. Yes, pine cone. Pine cone trees would look absolutely beautiful on this scenario of wait, it's not oh it's not winter, it's autumn. Okay. Just a little bit more days and it will become winter. Maybe not days, months, maybe more. Three months? Yes. November is that chili team so let's do it Now I don't know how much time it has taken but I think it has taken a lot of time and I'm almost there. Yay! We will totally finish this. Okay guys? You know me. Whatever I say, it comes true. And I don't know what I'd say. So nothing comes true. No, it will come true. Today I will. I will do it. So, this really is annoying, but in Germany, orange autumn trees are canopies. I thought that the canopies are maybe the green ones, but no, the canopies are actually the orange ones, which are larger than the green ones. So I would like to add few of mine. I have not grown a tree of canopy, but few of my own children. So I have omitted that island thingy, which actually is a part of that building, but I don't care. It's not the naturalistic bridge. Oh, you know what? I could use vines on it. Right, little bit of vine action. How does that look? Yeah, you can't see anything. Sorry, it's not to you referring that you are the viewer and the viewer is not seeing anything. No, the camera, this camera. Oh. No, okay, okay, yes. I thought that this broke this thing, this this thing, this broke. I thought, I thought that, but it isn't. So I am happy, 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 happy. But I'm kind of sad because I don't have any money to bring out any more books. Yeah, that's Shrek, but I changed it so that you can get attention to me. That's a very notable guy. Okay? You know what I could do? I could actually do the canopy like this so I can also use the clouds. It will look the same. This looks like overgrown devil's bridge means if people were dead and means or would have been abducted by aliens and after 20 years or about after 100 years people come back and they are the same age and they see the devil's bridge that's the way it would have looked <laughs> so overgrown because it's a naturalistic so I have to do that. Sorry. Oh man, why you crackle? This this thing always crackles. Uh, this makes me fear that this would break. And well, that's very unfortunate if that happens. 
Recebi uma brinca ali, um pintinho Ai. So, this is... A... Devil's Bridge, which is currently not done. Yes. Currently, in my, in my photo, it is done by 1860 only. So, this guy is really old, this ash bush. That's why I do some branches of vines coming out of it. Very little though, because I don't know why. <laughs> so, we'll just go on and do it and do it, do it, do it. I guess today's video would be a little less. Um, less time than the last one because last time it was 24 minutes and it's so long even I was not interested to see it anymore so here is another one my maple tree which is kind of orange by that time in the autumn here and this picture is my yellow here is my yellow who comes by and just colors the eye of the trees no trees don't have eye sorry but they have stomata so that is the stimuli product yeah, I know that much because I live in class 7 and I must know that, okay? And you might not know but my exams are coming for class 7 term 1 and it's pretty hard. So there may be a little days gap between few of the videos. So please do not... Be, get angry about that that why I am not active why I am inactive and why I am not responsible about this channel so I am about I wasn't about to say that but yeah I have to because or else you would have said these things and I know many people don't but few of them do so Just warning that I have exams nowadays. Maybe it might be this month only. I don't know. They have not given a notification. But my school have given me the syllabus to the exam and these all. So, and, and Sam. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that wasn't the sound effect. That was my own voice. Yeah. I also like singing, forgot, but we'll go to that topic later. So we have done, almost done this naturalistic bridge, which is very beautiful. This is gonna highlight the nature's main thing that makes it the optical illusion of a circle the devil's page and just gonna do that part and the clouds and voila you have your devil's page which is first time did in crayons yeah there are more videos about acrylic and these all but yeah first time you see color pencils never they are always the first 
uh, what colors are the um, that acrylic thing so make sure to check them out they are way better than my ones they are like the god of art and if you are one of them you can check them out then checking me out and if you just started learning and you want to draw a naturalistic bridge or hang one photo of that you can check for my one it's totally free i do not care if you cheat well if you cheat i will be angry but i don't care too much just by because you can learn stuff from me and this would be very helpful to you that's why i'm not restricting that you should not see my one and copy my one and these all but yeah you might have to think once or twice to copy that because it is taking me two days or three days because one day i was off but i don't guess you need three days most of them have much time in their hands and i have less time because i have exams and these all so these are just madness yeah just madness exams like can you imagine 80 marks 80 marks means about 90 percent of the marks will come from the question paper so i have to really read my copies a lot and do these things now so they have not finished so i guess they will when they finish they will i will say you that nowadays my exams are going on so i have to do it very little like that but now it's as it's not there and it is not going on exams i can freely draw but i have also to make sure that I read a lot or else I will really do the worst numbers. Okay, I never had a worst number in my life. I'm an average student in studying, not the best also, not the worst also. These are the bushes, little, little bushes, frightening on the way. No, they're not frightening me, but they might be frightening you. Okay. I'm not scared of the bush. Now oh, there's a wolf in it. Okay, not that scared. So we have just finished our own line, and now let's go on. And ooh, this is too much time. Okay, we will have to. So. I hope you like this and I have now completed the naturalistic slash the devil's bridge which is in Germany which is obviously called die Rakotsbruck in Germany that was hard so if you like this video then hit the like button if it was helpful to you you can subscribe and like I guess comment because nowadays there are less comment videos so and most importantly enjoy bye bye and also thank you to all you guys for the last video we did and now bye bye and see you all later with the new videos next time okay bye